I have been so much more extroverted in the past week than ever. And I'll tell you exactly how I did this. You simply take a few minutes out of your day to watch this video, bro. You will get a massive return on investment. And to not waste your time, I'll just tell you this story for context real quick. I've been in online school since the beginning of this school year, and I've been homeschooled for about two months now. And it's been such a great like experience with both, but most of this time, since I wasn't putting in the effort to be social, I was basically isolated. And I was like on self-improvement, so I'm not gonna hang out with retards. But there's no one in high level to hang out with. And I truly like I wish I wished I had that social fulfillment, which I have now. And I've been homeschooled for two months now. And about one and a half months ago, bro, I started being really social with strangers, with like with friends online, because there's no way I'm gonna find good friends in real life, bro. Online is the meta for finding friends. Anyway, that's not the point of this video. <laughs> I started being a lot more social, bro. Like I was a approaching the cute girls, getting into conversations with the gym chad, but then shit started to die down. Like. I stopped being as social, I got a little, like, I got a little pussy on the social act aspect of life, like, I started to get a tiny bit awkward again, like, I was, like, and this was happening for a solid month, bro, for a solid month, I was in my room and in the gym, bro, <laughs> it wasn't the shit that was making me feel like I could talk to people, it, like, I definitely didn't feel like that social butterfly like before, and then literally just a few days ago, I'm pretty much just as social as last time so what the fuck changed what makes it so that i randomly instantly started being more antisocial, and then all of a sudden a couple days ago instantly started being social again it's quite simply actually bro i was in a different location i'll get to why this matters in just a second bro it matters because when i'm in the location i'm at the time of recording this voiceover I go to a specific gym where there are motherfuckers to speak to and these motherfuckers are super nice in this gym. Here it's just nicely set up so that I can easily get into a social float in most places that I go. In this like where I am my, right now my environment is set up to be get into a social mood and a social flow. Over in the other location that I live in, it's a much more populated area in a like in an apartment which it sounds counterintuitive bro but if you actually think about it if there's more populated it means it's probably not as like vibey there's not as many happy people there's a lot of motherfuckers who already are with their friends it's much harder to get into a social flow because it's in like the social mood because like no one, basically no one gives a fuck about you they're all like with their own friends already and it's just like the people like most people aren't even like in like a good social vibe kind of nice people and stuff and then the people that are nice are basically don't give a fuck about you because they already have like friends around them that's like that's basically what the problem is it's not set up to for me to get into a social flow in this video clip like you, what you're watching right now i'm in the second location where i'm in this rut but I'm, when I'm actually recording this voiceover, like me actually, me talking right now, where I'm at right now, I'm in the first location that you'll probably see in like the next video um, on my channel that'll be uploaded tomorrow. So what am I getting at here, bro? What like actionable step can you take from this? Basically, just put in the effort to set up your life and your location to get you into a flow like the number one tip i always give to be more social is to be present and get into a social flow like if you try and walk out of your house <laughs> immediately to try and be that social chad motherfucker good luck bro good luck because like you gotta be you gotta be high level to be able to do that shit. <laughs> but what i'd say bro and what has helped me the most is having your shit set up so that you can be social and be fulfilled have have like have your shit set up so that it's kind of easy to get into a social flow and like i can't give you specific advice because i 
don't live with you <laughs> but but you need to just put in the effort bro like if you're pissed off enough you'll figure out how to optimize it you'll figure you'll you'll figure out how to make it so that you can be more social you'll you'll, you'll figure it out bro like i can't i can't be like go to your house and be like oh yeah bro like go to this gym and stuff like <laughs> you know i can't do that you just gotta find it you just gotta like put in this effort to make it so that you have this certain environment like I, it's just it's hard to like i really wish i could give you like a specific advice okay like set it up in this way and maybe like eventually once i make like a paid product that you know people can buy and maybe i could give a little bit of advice on that based on personal personal situation but right now bro this is a youtube video and so i can't give you personal like advice but what I can say is, if you want something enough, you'll get it. If you truly want something, you'll get that thing. I got you. Three, two, one, go! Oh yeah, oh yeah. One box! <laughs> yeah. Huh? Watch out! It's all about effort. It's all about mindset. So, yeah, I mean, you just have to set up your environment. The constraint... Uh, here, okay, make sure you clip this up, quote it, put it on your wall, or whatever the fuck. Make sure this is my, you know, my, uh, my legacy, right? The constraint is not you. It's your environment. That is what I want you to take away from this video. If anything, the constraint isn't you. You're not the problem. You not being so, like, it's not your mind, like, it, it, okay, it might be a little bit of your mindset, but most likely it isn't, like, a big part of it isn't you. The constraint is very likely where you live, like, how you approach certain situations, just your environment. Uh, it's when I wrote that down in the script, I fucking loved that. <laughs> I was like, yes, this is so good. <laughs> I was like, this is gonna be clipped up for ages. This is gonna be like, people are gonna be putting this on their wall. <laughs> no, I'm joking, bro. But yeah, that's what I've really found to be true. And so I hope this video helped you. Peace out. And I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.